Good morning. Welcome back. I'm on the ice. It's the first time I've actually got the shelter set up. I've been on the ice a couple times, haven't had very good luck, but finally it's like eight inches on the lake I'm at right now. I've never fished this lake, but I love it because it's not very pressured. There's no cabins on it. There's no people on it, but I've heard it's got some good fish, so I'm already setting up. Almost got everything set up. So much crap. That's the dumb thing I do about first ice. I bring so much gear. Just because I'm so excited to use all my technology. But anyway, I'm going to finish setting up. We're going to put the panoptics down and the underwater camera and see if we can get some cool shots of some strikes. So come along. fish on my plate right now. Oh, this is not planned. Look at that. He's staring at my bait. Oh, is he going to turn around? That's a big mark. I'm all iced up. Holy cow. It's a pretty big mark. Okay, stay tuned. Hopefully he comes back. Oh, right away. Whoa, that looks big on the optics. What do we got? Whoa! It's a huge crappie. Holy man. Whoa. Well, that was, uh, awfully quick. I uh, wasn't fully set up, but I think I captured it with the panoptics cam. Holy, that's a, that's a heck of a start. Came in and crushed that too. Jeez, that's big. Okay, mouth closed, 13 and a half bad for the first fish out on the ice holy it's a mega mega fish we gotta get a quick picture 13 and a half going back oh, Well, that was uh, quite awesome. Bite it. Yep, fish on. Yeah, much smaller than that last one. But he looks like he's got some big friends with him. So. Down right away. That one looks way up there too. Oh boy. I think I might have one on my on my minnow. No, maybe not. Not yet anyhow. Oh, come on. Oh, that's such a big fish. Turn around, turn around. Ah. Oh.
pretty small. Pretty small crappie. Hitting the medium sized dinner bell. That's pretty, pretty impressive. I mean, that's a pretty decent sized spoon with a little minnow head on it. That thing bites, it could be in for a heck of a fight. Something keeps swinging and messing with me. Look at that guy. Oh, there he got it. There he got it. <clears throat> it's decent. Oh, there's another decent crappie. <sighs> oh, yes. He was really charged up. Probably another 12, 13 incher. He was super charged up. Scared that big thing away, whatever that was. Let's go back. That's awesome. camera cord. Oh boy. Oh, I think he's out. It's a really nice walleye. Oh no, he came off. Ah. Ah. Oh, I had him like mere feet away. Oh, are you kidding me? He was so aggressive. That was huge too. Oh, that's so heartbreaking. I wish I could have showed you guys. Oh, it would have been ugh, so cool. That was just barely ready and he came in and crushed that. The heartbreak. I think I got him on camera though, the underwater camera. So that's pretty cool. <laughs> now that's a jumbo right there. That's not at all a jumbo, that's like six inches. Just wanted to see how big it was. Get a little size reference on my walleye that I just lost. So that walleye was probably only 18, 20 inches. Long. Tip up just went off for the first time. Something's pulling it. That's a good sign. Camera kind of set up. Sort of. GoPro just died, so I'm setting up my phone. I got a fish on the iFish Pro. And it's a beauty walleye. Yes, sir. Okay. Look at that beauty. That's like a 20 incher. First fish on the tip up. Beautiful day. I'm gonna put him back. If I can do this with my phone too. Alrighty. Woo! Alright, I gotta change batteries in the GoPro apparently. Didn't get the whole fight there. It's been a few hours since I've caught a fish. And I've moved about 20 times and haven't found any fish, so I'm gonna pack it in. It was a fun morning at least. Get a couple of live scope and underwater views. 
If you're interested in seeing more of that, hit subscribe. There is a lot more to come. So I'm going to take off and see you guys next time. Thanks for watching.